2015, I've had the opportunity to go to many sections and regions within our organization. I visited the UK and Ireland, Brazil, Iberia, Germany, Japan, Russia, the Middle East. It's given me an opportunity to meet with the leadership teams in all these countries. And it's very rewarding to see the energy and enthusiasm that all our leadership has exerted around the world. In 2016, I will visit other countries and regions that make up our organization, and so we continue to develop our sections around the world. Our online academy effort is incredible. We've worked for several years to develop this from the ground up. And it's really been the organization, the work that a tremendous number of people have put in to make this a successful effort. We've now reached our one year time point and we've really exceeded our expectations. We've had over 200,000 visits to the Online Academy, over 3 million page views, in each day, over 500 unique visits. This fall, we're gonna introduce another concept, a campus concept, where each of the regions and sections can create their own campus. And under that campus, they'll have classrooms, and they can create content within that at the local level for local groups. For example, all our study clubs, by the end of this year, we'll have 650 classrooms that each study club will be able to add their own content. And the beauty of that is that you can add that content in your native language. Our next World Symposium will take place in May of 2017 in Basel, Switzerland. And really Basel is the center of Europe. So it's an area where France, Germany, and Switzerland all come together and it's a great opportunity to start there and travel around Europe. So we would encourage you to mark your calendars for May of 2017 and come to this very exciting conference where the theme will be key factors for long-term success. It's now become time for us to create a new vision for the ITI. So we've gotten together and worked very hard to create a vision that we think is where our organization will need to be in 2020. This vision includes being more flexible to accommodate the growth of our organization and try to have more member benefit for you, the member. With that, we still focus on education and research, but also with the growth of our organization, our sections have become more prominent and so we want to spend more effort in helping each section create their own vision and their own strategic planning efforts. We also want to play a more integral role in developing future leaders in our organization. We've done that in the past with our scholarships. We want to continue with our scholarships, but have that even more focused on leadership development, both at the local level and at the national and international level. We have a lot of projects that are ongoing, and our growth has created new challenges. And implant dentistry has changed and brought new challenges as well. But we are confident that together with our partner, Strauman, that we are positioned to adequately move through to the future. We need to rely on you as fellows to implement these changes, and to you as our members to support these changes in growth and exciting future that we see in implant dentistry. Thank you so much for your trust and your confidence and your work for this great organization. It's fun to be a part of this effort and it's exciting to think about where we can take the organization. <music>